ladies and gentlemen, Leslie Crowther. and welcome to Stars in Their Eyes. Our five-star guests, ladies and gentlemen, are waiting in the wings, each of them hoping to be in next week's final, and one of them will be. And that person will join the winners in the series so far. Show one's Maxine Barriers, Shirley Bassey. Lady Show two's Chris Higgins as Krista Burr. You don't have to Show three's winner, beautiful. Sam Serono as Tom Jones. To turn and, of course, last week's winner, John Ensel, who won as Marty Pello. Four great finalists. Who will be the fifth? It may be our first star guest. Will you welcome Carol Ann Berry? Hello, you lovely girl. Carol Ann Berry, how lovely. And this is, this is just a little hint as to the work you used to do, a secretary, yes? Yes. Absolutely right. And shorthand, of course, you were good at that, weren't you? Rubbish. Rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I know why they've got that up there, I don't know. But it does look a bit like an astrological sign, and that you are keen on, aren't yeah, you? Very Astrology. Nice, yeah. yeah. And you're Pisces, aren't you? Yes, I am. Yes. Do you know what I am? You're an Aquarius. I'm an Aquarius. Yes, I am indeed. Russell Grant once told me that I've got Capricorn on the cusp. Really? Yes. <laughs> I mean, I've heard of water on the knee, but I was a bit worried about Capricorn on the... What does it mean, actually, that, on the cusp? Well, it's four days within each sign, as one sign comes into the other. Yeah. You know, four days, each way. I see. I yes. <laughs> I understood so... every word of that, didn't you? It's wonderful. You're a smashing lady. And who are you going to be for us tonight? Alison Moye. Alison Moye! Well... What about that? Good. Well, you believe in astrology and the stars, Carol Ann Berry, and tonight you are a star because tonight, singing live, Carol Ann Berry is Alison Moye. Took your time to come back this time The grass is growing under your feet In your absence I've changed my mind And someone else is sitting in your seat Cupid's arrow Now is the short and narrow I'm nothing left to offer you Don't 
brilliant start to the show. And now, please welcome our second star guest, Jeff Smith. <laughs> Hello, Jeff. Good to see you. What a very smart-looking gentleman you are, as befits a man who works in a bank, yes? Yes, the Royal Bank of Scotland. Yeah, well, you got that in. That was a good one. <laughs> yeah. Very nice. And what, uh, what, what position do you hold there? Um, well, it's advances supervisor. Yes. Which I prefer to call senior clerk. I see. And you arrange loans, do you? Yes. You're the loan arranger? Yes. <laughs> Do you get some silly questions asked when you're, when you're in the bank? Not so much silly as, as different. Yeah. Um, occasionally you get someone come in and ask for a left-handed checkbook. And left-handed checkbook? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> now then, Jeff, who are you going to be for us tonight? Johnny Mathis. Johnny Mathis! <laughs> well, by day, Jeff, you are an account supervisor, but tonight, singing live, Jeff Smith is Johnny Mathis! <laughs> As a kitten up a tree And I feel like I'm clinging to a cloud I can't understand I got misty just holding your hand Walk my way a thousand violins begin to play Or it might be the sound of your hello That music I hear I got to stay the moment you're near You can say that you're leaving Don't you notice how hopelessly I'm lost? That's why I'm following you. On my own, should I wander through this wonderland alone? Never knowing my right foot from my left. My hat, my glove I'm too misty And too much in love I got misty And too much in love Look at And now our next star guest, Jimmy Jermaine. <laughs> Great to see you. Now, you're, you are a fully qualified motor mechanic, right? Yes, that's right. That's good. And uh, this is what... Tell us about this. Well, this I bought nearly 17 years ago. Yeah. And I bought it from a farmer for three pounds. Yeah. And it was in his barn. It had been, it had been in his barn for about 20 years. Yeah. And uh, it was only last year I, I had time and money to restore it. So that's what I did. That's lovely. Now, have you any idea, I think the likeness is quite incredible, who this young man is going to be? Cliff Richard. Cliff Richard, you can't get away with it. <laughs> Fortunately for you, and that's why you sound like him, it's unbelievable. He sounds like me. Oh, do <laughs> <laughs> That's very, very good. And you, you share all sorts of similarities, don't you? This is incredible, tell them. We do. Uh, I even went to the same school, which is Riversmead School in Chesant, as well. Amazing. Yeah. Jimmy Germain. Um, Qualified motor mechanic during the day, but tonight, singing live, Jimmy Germain is Cliff Richard.
Ladies and gentlemen, three prospective winners in the first half and two more in the second. But who's going to actually win? Stay with us and find out. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Stars in Their Eyes and a special welcome to our next star guest, a lovely lady, Nancy Heaton. <laughs> Mwah. Mwah. Oh, you, do, you look incredible. You obviously work in a fish and chip shop, don't you, Nancy? I do, yeah. Uh, and what's it called? A little advertisement here? Uh, it's in Farmworth. It's Moses Gate, and it's called the Moses Gate Chipper. Good. That's all we need to know. <laughs> what kind of fish do your customers ask for most? Well, we only sell one. <laughs> Ask a silly question, right. Cod, I suppose, is it? Yes, it's, it's cod. A... Now then, what about that time? If I mentioned fire, would it mean a lot to you? Uh, well, yes, vaguely. Go on then, tell, me, tell us about that moment. Well, before I work for the people that have got it now... Yes. Um, I work for the... Well, obviously, I work for the other people. <laughs> It's, a, it's an adventure, isn't it, really? <laughs> I burnt it down. You what? <laughs> well, you I, burnt it down? It's good as, yeah. Um, and while you, while you were being wheeled away, a lady stopped. Oh, and, yes. And what did this lady say? Uh, she come running in and the place was gutted and she said, have you got anything left? <laughs> But who are you going to be for us tonight? Tonight, Leslie, Eartha Kitt. Eartha Kitt, ladies and gentlemen. There you are. Tonight, Nancy Heaton singing live is Eartha Kitt. Not sophisticated, I'm the sweet and simple kind I'd like an old 
old-fashioned house with an old-fashioned fence and an old-fashioned millionaire. I'd like a plain, simple car, a Saris Cadillac, long enough to fit a bowling alley in the back. I'd like an old-fashioned house with an old-fashioned fence and an old-fashioned millionaire. I'd stay weaving at my loom. No trouble to my groom if he'll keep the piles of money mounting. In a cottage there would be a soundproof nursery, not to wake the baby while I'm counting. I like the old-fashioned flowers, violets are for me. Have them made in diamonds by the man at Tiffany. I want an old-fashioned house with an old-fashioned fence. And an old-fashioned millionaire I'm such a pilgrim at heart Oh, so pure and genteel Catch me in Las Vegas When I'm at the spinning wheel I want an old-fashioned house With an old-fashioned fence And an old-fashioned millionaire I like Chopin and Bizet and the songs of yesterday, string quartets and Polynesian carols. But the music that excels is the sound of oil wells as they slurp, slurp, slurp into the barrels. My little home would be quaint as an old parasol. And instead of carpets, I'd have money wall to wall. I want an old fashioned house. With an old-fashioned fence and an old-fashioned millionaire. Ah, <laughs> oh, sensational performance, love. Great. Now will you welcome our final star guest for this evening, Keith Ivett. There we are. There we are, my dear. Good to see you. Don't you look good? Oh, look at all this. Wonderful. Well, here are all the clues, Keith, as to your, the nature of your work. That's obviously a touch of the old seaside. And this, by gum, I knew that when it was a deck chair. <laughs> tell, tell us what you do. I work at a holiday centre in the summer. Do you? Yes. Oh, good. And where? Which one? Burnham on Sea. Ah, oh, lovely. But you're you're not from there, are you? No, I'm from South Wales. South Wales. Got. When you were a young fella, you you were doing impressions even then, Keith, weren't you? Yeah. When I was in school, I used to impersonate the teachers, and I got in terrible trouble. I'm sure you did. I'm sure you did. And never mind the sympathy; it doesn't deserve it. I'm sure you did because, of course, in person they came in and caught you at it, didn't they? Yes, I'm doing impressions. <laughs> Perhaps I could have rephrased that a little more. <laughs> well, that's remarkable. So who, dear sir, are you going to be for us tonight? Tonight, I'm going to be Barry Manilow. Way! <laughs> well, Keith Ivert, entertainer extraordinaire. Tonight, singing live, you are Barry Manilow. <laughs>
And they're singing live, all our star guests, ladies and gentlemen. They are not miming, they are singing live, and that is tremendous, <laughs> is it not? Very good. Well, now we come to the crunch time again, because, as you very well know, we turn to our studio audience, for it is their vote that decides who will join Shirley Bassey, Krista Burr, Tom Jones and Marty Pello in our final next week. They have to choose one winner from Alison Moyer, Johnny Mathis, Cliff Richard, Eartha Kitt and Barry Manilow. And each voting member of our studio audience, ladies and gentlemen, is individually plugged into our stars in their eyes computer. All they have to do is press the buttons and the computer does the rest. So, fingers on your buttons and cast your votes now. Liv Richard! Yeah. 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 Come here, sir. Come here. Ah, come here. How ah, lovely. Well done. Thank you. Are you thrilled? What can I say? Oh, that's Thank great. You. Absolutely great. Well, there we are, ladies and gentlemen. Bless your heart. Jimmy is going to join our other finalists in our grand final next week. But until then, of course, tonight quite rightly belongs to Jimmy Germain. There you are, sir. Keep going. Here we go. Yeah. All along the line, I've been true to you. Yeah. 